Hi Lynn, Spencer from Prime Motor Cars, Mercedes-Benz in Scarborough, Maine. Uh, we emailed back and forth about a couple of models. I wanted to show you a vehicle I think is a, a great fit for you. So a couple of questions you had. I know you mentioned looking at the 53, we looked at the 350 and you hadn't considered the 450. Um, physically, the dimensions of the vehicle don't change. So between the different uh, GLE 350, 450 and 53, the actual physical dimensions of the vehicle stay the same. So it's just over, just a hair over 16 feet long, 193 inches, and just a little bit over uh, six feet wide, but the same dimensions through all the different GLE uh, model lineup. So if it's able to fit in your garage with one, then it should be uh, the other. So uh, the vehicle to my right is a GLE 450. So this is where you get that six cylinder engine. Um, this particular model is in Mojave Silver Metallic. It's a very, very nice vehicle. Um, similar styling to the first model we looked at, AMG line gives us a much more kind of sporty and stylish front bumper and grille. Chrome work uh, is very, very nice looking with the Mojave Silver. And as we come along the side of the vehicle, painted fenders, 21 inch multi-spoke wheels, but they're still on all season tires. Um, beautiful uh, chrome work along the uh, window frame running boards available on this vehicle as well as we come along to the rear our GLE 450 again signifying our six cylinder engine and our uh, formatic system so the all-wheel drive uh, dual exhaust parking sensors along the back this model does have an optional trailer hitch as well um, I know there are a couple of features you were looking for specifically uh, in in the model what this vehicle does have I'll go over with you as we take a closer look at the interior um, so we'll show you really quickly here the inside this is a very nice espresso brown and black interior Again, 2020 brought a redesigned uh, GLE interior and exterior. So 2021, like this model, again, giving us a really nice set of options. Um, and then moving forward to the driver and passenger seat, where we see a big change in the dashboard seat layout, just like the other model we looked at here, but a nice espresso brown black uh, combination interior. The key to this model is the fact that this is a GLE 450. To put it into perspective, um, the GLE models right now are, are difficult to find. And out of all my inventory, all of my available GLE 350 models, I have two 450s available for sale. So a lot harder to come by, but a really nice uh, set of options. Let's take a closer look at the inside. Inside the GLE, we can take a closer look at the interior. Um, I know a couple options you mentioned that were important to you. Number one, and I think the biggest option is the driver's assistance plus package. This vehicle does have that. So that includes your radar guided cruise controls, lane and steering assist, but a lot of other really nice safety features like your active braking, um, you have a lane changing assist, you have a, a lot of different uh, safety features also available. Uh, panoramic roof, also a feature you mentioned available in this model. So standard sunroof is a lot smaller. It's a regular size sunroof. The panoramic roof is two big pieces of glass, really opens up the cabin. Uh, comfort features in this model include heated and ventilated seats. We have a heated steering wheel. Uh, our two 12 inch displays, just like the previous model, MBUX is a new touchscreen system. We can run Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, a lot of really, really nice features uh, in this particular model. Uh, wireless charging, dual zone climate control, your remote start is done right through your Mercedes app, so we can run all of our remote start features. You can start the car, lock it, unlock it, locate the vehicle on a map. It'll alert you if your windows are open, if your sunroof is open, or the doors are left open or unlocked. Um, again, wanted to give you a video tour of this GLE 450. I think this model is a good fit for what we're looking for. Almost uh, every box uh, checked on the uh, wants for vehicle. So if you have any questions, 207-210. 4796. That's my cell phone number. Uh, my email is sro. That's s r o e at driveprime.com. Uh, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed.